Welcome to Configure Any Connect VPN Client on Firepower Threat Defense. In this video, we will show you how to configure a DHCP server for address assignment. First, we need to configure the DHCP scope on the server. You right click on IPv4 and select New Scope. We configure the name of the scope and its description. We then select the range of IP addresses to be handed out by this scope and its subnet mask. After clicking on Finish, don't forget to activate the scope. Now, on the FMC, let's go to Devices, VPN, and click on Remote Access. Let's click on Edit DHCP Connection Profile and delete the existing pool. In the DHCP server section, click on the plus symbol and create an object that contains the IP address of the DHCP server. Then, select that object as the DHCP server. Now, let's click on Edit Group Policy, DNS slash Wins, and click on the plus symbol to create a new network object. This object will contain the DHCP scope. It is important to create this network object as a host. Let's save these changes and deploy the configurations. We can verify these configurations by going into the FTD CLI and issuing a show run tunnel group. And the show run group policy commands. To verify that this DHCP server is reachable, we can ping its IP. To test this setup, we have Wireshark listening for DHCP packets on the DHCP server. When we initiate a remote access connection, we can see the DHCP exchange on Wireshark. If we open up the discovery packet, we can see that this is a unicast packet sent from the FTD's inside interface to the DHCP server and the relay agent IP address shows the DHCP scope. On the AnyConnect client, we can verify that we were given an IP address from the DHCP scope. Thank you for watching. See you next time.